Hi, this is Fabio Murri, and in this video I would like to show you some insights from my latest demo for BSL MIR-X Synchron Stage Extension. The goal of this track was showing the integration of the virtual instrument series with Synchron libraries through this newest MIR-X Synchron Stage Extension. I took the chance to write something for one of my favorite BSL libraries, Solo Voices. So the main goal was to write for the Solo Voices library in combo with the Big Bang Orchestra Ganymede Choir to test how they blend thanks to the newest Mir X extension. The result was this track which I think has certainly fantasy game soundtrack vibes. That's why I included also some solo instruments from Recorders and Historic Winds 1 and 3. I would suggest to refer to the official videos that you can easily find while they cover in deep what Mir X is and what it does. In this video I'm gonna show you only the presets and the tweaks I've done to achieve the sound for this track. For the Big Bang Orchestra libraries I used mainly the classic room mix and I think the only tweak I've done was muting some of the additional mics and the internal reverb of the synchron player because we'll see in a moment that I'm gonna use an external reverb for the tail while for the virtual instrument series I obviously used the synchron stage Mir X extension and for the solo instruments in particular solo voices I selected the profile solo center which plays the instrument uh, and in the middle of the stage where you expect the soloist to be. Finally I left untouched the dry wet ratio at 64. As previously mentioned and as I always do I have an instance of Miracle on the master bus. Usually I use the delicate shimmer presets in this case, I'm with the wet fader at around minus 19. And it's a long but very pleasant um, reverb to add that extra tail, which just helps to smoother, especially every end of the phrase, and in general to blend even more all the instruments of the track together. One of the first orchestration choices was to select the right singer for the sound I was looking for. The fact that all the singers share exactly the same articulation structure, and with BSL libraries that's always the case, it was easy to program the phrase just once and then moving it around the female voices to hear the results. In the end I selected the mezzo-soprano and the alto, since even on the high register they preserve a darker and less operatic quality, which is what I wanted for this fantasy game soundtrack. And finally, this is how Ganymede and Solo Voices sound together. Here we have on the solo line uh, the mezzo-soprano with the female sections and on the second half the male sections entering as well. To add just a little bit of extra movement and body, especially in the low uh, frequencies, I used the large sections of Zodiac with the strings playing tremolo and the low strings from Muska playing pizzicato. To add to the fantasy vibes of the track, I use instead the alto recorder doubling the soprano two octaves above and a natural horn in C.
From a mixing perspective, I added to the female sections of the choir the Stereo Power Panner Pro, which comes with the super useful Vienna Suite Pro. And this is to create more space in the middle for the soloist. In the composition, two natural horns this time are covering the breaks in the choir riding. The next important layer in the orchestration is provided by the brass section. The Hercules trombones are playing sustained chords, while the Jupiter horns take over the natural horn in the chorus section of the composition. Finally, we have a simple but effective pattern played by the monster drums from BBO Dorado and some extra low hits from the big timpani that you can find in BBO Fornax. Before playing the full track, I would like you to notice how relatively simple and compact is this arrangement and I think that's the key of the Big Bang Orchestra and the integration of Mir X Synchron Stage Extension. This combination has the simplicity and the effectiveness of um, a sketching tool while the result could actually be your final track, in my opinion. I really hope you found these insights helpful for you. Thanks for watching and see you next time.